Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the drawer support in a GE range. It's going to be a very easy repair. should only take a minute or two to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a Phillips screwdriver. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new drawer support. This drawer support is mounted on the front lower portion of the wrench frame. It allows the drawer to glide in and out. The main reason for the drawer support to be replaced is if it breaks off, causing the drawer to jam. We're going to remove the broiler drawer by pulling it straight out, then lifting up and slide it out. This drawer glide is held in place by a single Phillips screw mounted through the center. So we're going to use the Phillips screwdriver. And we're going to remove that screw and the glide. This is the old drawer support next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. We can install this uh, drawer glide uh, with the pin goes into this opening at the bottom. And then we're going to secure it to the chassis with a Phillips screw. To replace the opposite side glide, we'll have to repeat the procedure. So we're going to install a broader drawer. And I'm going to place the glides over the glide that mounted on the chassis. And we're going to slide it in. And now when we're done, you can plug the wrench back in. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other videos available on our site, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram. 